Today we have brought you the latest Tesla news. BMW adopts Tesla's EV charging standard NAX. Tesla cuts price of midnight cherry red paint option. Tesla confirms Cybertruck deliveries for November 2023. And Tesla's next software update will make supercharger visits more predictable. Let's get into all the details. So let's get started. BMW has announced it is adopting the North American charging standard, NAX, designed by Tesla. Drivers of BMW, Mini, and Rolls-Royce electric vehicles in North America will have access to the Tesla supercharger network in early 2025. BMW of North America and Rolls-Royce motor cars announced that drivers of BMW, Mini, and Rolls-Royce with combined charging system, CCS, in the US and Canada, will gain access to designated Tesla supercharger stations in early 2025. In the coming months, the companies will work together to provide a seamless customer experience, allowing company vehicle drivers to easily find and access available superchargers on their vehicle display. In addition, as part of the cooperation, the companies want to enable their customers to make payments through the branded application of the corresponding car. The BMW Group will adopt the North American Charging Standard, NAX, for its battery electric vehicles in the US and Canada, starting in 2025. The announcement comes after numerous other manufacturers have already announced similar collaborations. Ford and General Motors were early adopters, so their electric vehicles will be the earliest to be produced with the new charging ports. They will also have access to Tesla's wide supercharger network in North America before others. BMW also remains committed to its earlier plan to form a joint venture with six other automakers that will build a powerful new electric vehicle charging network in North America. The new joint venture aims to build at least 30,000 new chargers in metropolitan areas and along major highways, which will be available to drivers of all battery electric vehicles from any automaker. These charging stations will offer CCS and NAX charging standards. However, at the moment, the joint venture has not yet been created. Moving to the next update, Tesla cuts price of midnight cherry red paint option. Tesla cut the price of the midnight cherry red paint option in Europe, making the unique red color more affordable for customers. Tesla configurator page reveals that midnight cherry red now costs 2,600 euros, which is $2,743 which was previously priced at €3,200 Euros or $3,376. The new price of Midnight Cherry Red brings it closer to the cost of Tesla's red multi-coat paint option in the United States, which is priced at $2,000. As of this video, Tesla only offers the Midnight Cherry Red paint option for Model Y units, sold in Europe and the Middle East. The unique color option is developed at Giga Berlin's next generation paint shop which only produces Model Y vehicles. As a result, Midnight Cherry Red is unavailable for Model 3 units, sold anywhere worldwide. Demand for Tesla Giga Berlin's Midnight Cherry Red color was evident by delivery estimates on the company's website. In May, the estimated delivery dates for Model Y units in Midnight Cherry Red were between August to September 2023. Tesla Germany's delivery estimates for Model Y units and other paint options, including Quicksilver, were between May to June 2023. As of this video, paint options do not appear to affect Model Y delivery estimates in Europe, hinting that Tesla has found a way to meet the demand for Midnight Cherry Red Model Y orders. Interestingly enough, Tesla Giga Berlin's Quicksilver paint option costs more than Midnight Cherry Red now. It costs €3,000, which is $3,165. The two new colors rolled out simultaneously are unique to Giga Berlin's paint shop. However, Quicksilver has been eclipsed by Midnight Cherry Red's popularity. Moving to the next update, Tesla confirms Cybertruck deliveries for November 2023. Tesla has confirmed that it will make the first deliveries of the Cybertruck on November 30, 2023. 
With Tesla's Q3 2023 shareholder deck, many investors were looking for any sort of indication of the progress of production of the Cybertruck. It seems the automaker has stopped teasing fans and investors alike and explicitly stated in the earnings release for the third quarter that it will begin the first deliveries of the Cybertruck in November. The announcement was made atop a picture of the all-electric semi, with several Cybertruck units packed on the back, perhaps foreshadowing what will likely be a popular side in the coming years. Tesla will begin Cybertruck deliveries four years after the automaker initially unveiled the vehicle in 2019. The automaker stated in its earnings shareholder deck that the Cybertruck is in the pilot production phase and lists its annual capacity as greater than 125,000 units annually. The truck will be built at Gigafactory Texas outside Austin, and the news of the imminent launch follows many sightings of the Cybertruck outside of the company's production plant. For most of 2023, Tesla has teased fans with Cybertruck-related content. Everything from the pickup wrapped in various designs to it being test-driven in the desert has been used by Tesla to hype up the initial appearances of the all-electric Cybertruck for all of 2023. Although it is several years late, it is the perfect way to cap off what has been a monumental year for Tesla. The company still plans to deliver 1.8 million units this year, and while it may be a tough achievement to reach in 2023 because of its lackluster Q3, the Cybertruck has a steady sheet of reservations that Tesla will work to fulfill over the coming years. Demand for the Cybertruck is high and has reached over 2 million units. Moving to the last update, Tesla's next software update will make supercharger visits more predictable. Tesla's next software update, version 2023.38, will make supercharger visits much more predictable. Tesla has already started releasing 2023.38 to some owners, and one of the features it has added is predictive supercharger availability. The feature aims to use data to predict how many superchargers might be available at a station when you're on your way to it. Although Tesla already has live data for superchargers, which tells you how many stalls are available out of how many there are at a specific station, this new feature aims to predict how many will be available when you get there instead of how many are available in real time. Not a Tesla app first discovered the feature. It seems Tesla is taking supercharger availability a step further by helping owners and drivers have statistically backed and data-driven predictions on how many stalls might be open to you when you arrive. If you're taking a road trip and your next supercharger stop is a couple hundred miles away, there are obviously going to be some changes in how many stalls are available now compared to when you arrive. With more automakers choosing to adopt Tesla's North American charging standard, the need for availability predictors is more relevant than ever. Even though Tesla continues to build more supercharger stalls every day, there is absolutely a need for more predictive measures, as more cars will have access to the stalls. In the spring, Ford and General Motors will gain access to 12,000 North American Tesla supercharger locations. As these two automakers are popular in terms of legacy automakers to adopt Tesla's NAX connector, superchargers are going to be more packed and busier than ever. Not to mention, automakers, including Rivian, Fisker, Honda, Kia, Hyundai, and several others, will also gain access to the Tesla supercharger network. It is important to continue refining supercharger availability features, giving those who are in need of EV charging an opportunity to prepare for a wait or perhaps continue traveling on to a less congested supercharger location. That's it for now. So what are your thoughts about this? Let us know in the comments. Stay tuned at the Electric Arena for all the latest Tesla and electric vehicle news.